Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm, I'm here with my friend Kyle and my friend Caleb, and I just want to talk a little bit, just for a moment, about this concept of praying for people that, with, with back pain, where it, it's resulting in, in one of their legs actually being shorter than the other or longer than the other, and praying for them and watching their leg actually grow out. Um, recently, my friend Kyle and I, we watched this documentary. It was a Christian documentary where they, they really came hard against this this whole thing of, of praying for somebody with uh, where one of their legs was shorter than the other, and they even they came after uh, a guy, a, a well-known uh, leader just in the body of Christ named Todd White, and they even called him a magician. And they were like, "Oh, apparently there's this big epidemic where the one where people have longer legs than the other one, and this and that and the other." And and they were just uh, tried to act like it was all fake, and. It was just really crazy. Kyle and I were watching this documentary, and we're like, man, we've actually seen this so many times, like, for, from our personal experiences where we've prayed for people. And, and what it is is usually if somebody has back pain, if you sit them down in a chair or up against the wall and you look at their legs, oftentimes one of them will be longer than the other. And usually it's just a little bit. Sometimes it's more than others. But what, what that is, it, we, we begin to pray for the leg to grow out and really what's happening is the Lord is shifting something in their back and that's why the leg grows out. But I wanted to, to even bring my friend Kayla because last spring uh, Kyle and I were praying for our friend Kayla and, and it was actually the, the biggest significant growth we've ever seen um, personally. And I just want to share, you know, tell them a little bit about what was with your, what happened with your back and everything like that, what, what the situation was. Yeah. Uh, so when I was younger, um, I was really into sports and athletics and running and stuff. Um, and through all that, I, I just took a lot of toll on my body. Um, and specifically, um, I did gymnastics for a while and took a bad landing mm -hmm. and developed uh, mild scoliosis that um, over the years developed into more severe scoliosis. It was resulting in migraines and um, you know all these different issues throughout my body uh, kind of sprung up from the scoliosis. And it's just something I learned to deal with, and there wasn't, you know, realistic surgery or anything I could do to fix that. Um, they basically just said, take some medicine, you know, learn to live with it. And so um, you had back pain kind yes. of all the time. Yeah, exactly. And so one day, we're, we're just like in the hallway at our school, and Caleb starts to talk to Kyle, and he's like, man, I got this back pain, and Kyle is like, dude, why don't, why don't let's sit down, let's take a look at your legs. Yeah, so yeah. Go ahead and tell them the story. Yeah, as soon as Caleb told me he had scoliosis, I'm like, what do you mean he has scoliosis? Like, dude, we gotta pray for you. Like, come, come over here, like, let's sit you down. Like, like let's pray for you because yeah. I've seen multiple times where, you know, that is the sole problem. If you go to a chiropractor, it's the first thing they check is to see if your feet are aligned. Huh. Um, so I just, you know, know to sit people down. And so we did Caleb and, uh, the results as soon as he sat down were like dramatic. It he was, was wearing a pair of Vans and Vans have a thick sole. It was very dramatic and the cool thing about this is I was right there and I actually got it on film and so I'm gonna put that that clip it's just a one minute clip of and you you can see for yourself his leg grows out and, 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 is, and is completely even by the end of it and so we wanted to share this testimony with you guys to encourage you and and also just like like this is a real thing guys Kyle and I both agree like we I mean we see this all the time I've never actually seen a leg not grow out when I when I prayed for for it to happen and uh, um, it's just it's very frequent and it's it's awesome and it's a testimony of Jesus's healing work and so it's just it's it was just really bugging us this concept that this isn't a real thing because we've seen it so many times. And so I'm going to put that video on and I hope that your faith is encouraged uh, just by this testimony and even by the video. So bless you guys. That is crazy. That's probably like the most I've ever seen. Like you're almost like a whole like shoe like off. Oh, it doesn't feel great. <laughs> doesn't that feel great? Just holding it like this? No, no, just in general. <laughs> okay. I knew something was All right. Father, we come to you in the name of Jesus right now. I just command this leg to grow in Jesus' name. We command alignment right now. Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Left leg grow. 
right now. In Jesus' name, spine align. I command these feet to align right now. In Jesus' name. Feet align in Jesus' name. Left leg grow, grow, grow. It's like halfway there. Jesus' name. Left leg, come on, come on. Hip, I command you to shift in Jesus' name. Come, Jesus, come, Jesus, come, Lord, come. More, well.